All right, guys, we're gonna try out a cast iron cylinder head here today. We have a detergent in the machine with a fine mesh glass bead. We're currently running four blasting guns and we're gonna set this process up. We're gonna enter in 22 inches. That is the part height. All right, part height is set. And media selection, we're gonna go in here to glass bead. Okay, so we got the door closed. Uh, you can see up here we have a wa water temperature readout right now saying it's 88 degrees. And we have the chemical in there with the media. So we're gonna go ahead and cycle start. Machine's coming down to its starting position. Okay, so we've laid the cylinder head down. So the first cycle is 20 minutes. And right now we've laid it down on the turntable. We're gonna try to get some different angles on the part. Um, so we're gonna program this part again. So let me get visualization. All right, here we go. So we're selecting the abrasive, what size abrasive, and of course the height of the part. You can see how quick this is to change the height of the part. And then cycle start. Then the guns are going to travel down. And then it's going to start. And we can't see after that. Okay, guys, so here's after 20 minutes. And this thing did really well. There's a lot of very complex, intricate detail work in here. This is a cast iron part, so we're not looking for polish. We're just looking for clean and honestly paint prep, but we don't have the correct abrasive for paint prep. This is a glass bead, um, but it's removing the enamel, whatever coating that is, plus all of the corrosion and contaminants on this part. That's pretty impressive. That was 20 minutes, hands-free. There is an aqueous based chemical in there, plus the glass bead, the fine glass bead. So everyone here is all shocked at how well this came out. So we're gonna flip it, turn it, rerun it a couple times, and then we'll be back. 